next we are going to see about verification by addition okay so whether uh, the first step is you subtract the number so whether the subtracted number is correct you can cross check with it by addition okay that is what verification by addition mean. okay done so let me teach you the first example subtract 2837 from 6952 and verify by addition so as i already told you if there is a from in the question second number in the first line first number in the second line okay this is the first step step 1 okay so second number in the first line first number in the second line what is the next thing as usual you need to subtract here we have to 7 whether 2 can get subtracted from 7 no above number is smaller so you are going to get 1 from this so this will become 12 this will become 4 12 minus 7 Four minus three, one. Nine minus eight is one. Six minus two is four. Okay, this part of uh, subtraction we have seen in the last two sections. So just uh, try to recall the subtractions that we did in the last two sections. First section we have seen the examples. Then next we see the exercises. Now we are going to going on with verification. Okay, so I got the answer as four one one five. Now, whether the answer is correct or not, I need to check it, right? So, whether the answer is correct or not, whether I have subtracted right or wrong, so I have to check it, right? So, in that situation, we can do a addition. Okay, so the below number, write the below number as it is two eight three seven. Right as it is, fine. So in the above, you're going to write the answer four one one seven. So sorry, seven five four one one five. Okay, I'm going to write this number on the above. Second number, right as it is. For the above number, you're going to write the answer of the subtracted number. Okay, now. What you are going to do now? Addition. We have seen already addition. So add it. Five plus seven is twelve. For one first number up, second number down. One plus one two. Two plus three five. One plus eight is nine. Four plus two is six. Do you got the answer? Yes. That is this answer is seen. Six nine five two. Yes. Okay, six nine five two. If this one and this one are same, you are correct. Okay, your answer is correct. Fine. Next, next, I'll give you one more example. Then we'll see some more exercise based on this one. So as usual, the second number in the first line. And first number in the first line. Sorry, second line. Okay, subtract it. One minus one is zero. Three minus nine. The above number is smaller. What we can do? Get one from the from your friend, which is a neighbor who is sitting next to you. So this will become thirteen, and this will become two. Thirteen minus nine, four. Two minus two is zero. Eight minus two is six. Okay, so the subtracted number is a six zero four zero. Where do we write this number? Right in the first line. Now what you're going to do? Add. So this number is written here. Okay. So now add zero plus one one. Nine plus sorry four plus nine thirty. One above, three below. One plus two is three. Six plus two is eight. 
So do you got the same answer? Yes. 8331. Same answer, right? Of course, your subtraction is 100% correct. Okay. So this concept is known as verification by addition. So in the next section, we'll see some exercise based on the verification by addition.